This is Antigone and Ashara from University of Wealth on Campus TV, and we're here with the amazing Shane Cod. How are you feeling? Thanks very much. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited to be here. This is uh, my first ever time in Bath, so first yeah, ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So have you seen any of it? I haven't really seen any. Just got in. And it's dark, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. yeah. How does it feel like playing live again? Yeah, it's it's unreal to be honest. So I never really got to play like too much live before because my last track I produced yeah, it in, yeah. in the lockdown and it just kind of took off for me. So this yeah. is probably like my fifth or sixth proper gig. Like I've done like the local bars and like the small a small town in Ireland where I live. Like yeah. and my mates' birthday parties, but this is like way bigger. <laughs> you know, so <laughs> I get a nervous. Bit <laughs> just a yeah, bit. yeah. <laughs> and yeah, how does it feel to like have a lockdown hit? Essentially, like get in my head is massive. And yeah, yeah how. Still don't know how it feels to be honest. Still kind of like letting it sink in. Uh, just unbelievable. So grateful as well because that's what I wanted. You know, I've always wanted to be making music and being able to DJ live and for it to be my career. So now it's finally happening. I'm just very grateful. You know. Yeah, incredible. So obviously your new single always on my mind. Yeah. So now you're playing on stage. What's on your mind right now? Like yeah. before you go on. I'm um, just nerves. Like <laughs> how am I gonna? How am I gonna be? I don't know. It's usually when you get on after a few tunes, get a bit more relaxed and uh, yeah. start to enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah, and that's why we have some amazing um, Europe DJs warming up the crowd for you right now. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, uh, you're also just getting started, but do you have any advice for people coming up right now? I'd just say um, just keep making the, the music that you like to make, and then if you like it, then hopefully other people will like it as well. So, yeah, that's what I'd yeah. say. Yeah. Who was, like, your musical inspirations that, like, got you into that? Yeah. Probably, like, uh, a lot of, like, 90s and 2000s dance music, mainly. But then Avicii would have been a big one as well, because, yeah. like, I remember going to Avicii when I was, like, 15 or 16 mm -hmm. in a concert, and it was just blew my mind. So, yeah. like, yeah, definitely Avicii and old-school old dance music. Yeah. Amazing. And it's, it's great that you got to see him. Yeah, yeah. I saw him twice, I think, yeah. He was, on, he was unreal, yeah. Yeah. Um, and kind of, obviously, you went from graduating uni to now headlining several, like, Freshers' Week, aco mm, Freshers yeah. Weeks across the country. Yeah. Insane. How, yeah, how does no, that feel? Yeah, yeah. No, I actually didn't even graduate. You oh, know, to be honest, with you. I, I had a year left, and it was actually while the song was kind of blowing up for me. I was back and forth to the UK, so I actually put it on hold. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't plan. I hated it to be honest. What I, were you doing? Of course, I was doing. I was doing business, but I was doing business true Irish. Okay. Oh. So I remember like the first day going in there. I didn't even. I didn't even realize the whole thing was true Irish. Like I thought it was business and Irish. Yeah. And like I'm fluent in Irish and all. Like in Ireland, like I went to like Irish primary schools, all that stuff. But like the whole thing was true Irish, and I was like, oh no, I didn't like it from You're the first like, day. So I got like three years in, and then obviously music started to take off me a bit. I was just delighted, like that's what I wanted to do. So that's really interesting because I do management, I do business management, but not in Irish. Yeah. Can you do, can you teach me like some like business term in Irish? Can you learn business me? term in Irish. Mm -hmm. um, well, a company would be a canolocked. So that's a company in Irish. Say yes. That again? A cano canolocked. Canolocked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Canolocked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Interesting. Yeah. So what are your like next plans for music? Like, are you thinking next plans for me? Yeah, I have a new track coming out in four weeks' time now, at the end of October. Amazing. Yeah, and yeah. What's that about? Yeah, uh, what's it about? Yeah. It's just, it's just another. I, I like to say, a piano house banger. That's what I want to say. Piano house banger. That's what we want. <laughs> yeah, that's what we yeah, need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So um, yeah, I'm dropping that in four weeks, and I'm doing a tour of Ireland as well, and actually, yeah. parts of the UK. I'm going to Scotland and stuff. So it's all going to be kind of based around the new song and stuff as well, yeah. and then. I'm getting another tune ready for January, which I can't really say too much about now, but yeah. we're hoping it's going to be like, you know, we're going to try and make it as big as we can, you know, so, yeah, just new music and do, yeah. do as many shows as they can as well, yeah. Sounds amazing. Yeah. Um, okay, I have an important question. Do you have any, like, cool Freshers memories? Cool Freshers memories? Oh, it's probably just, like, drunk the whole time. Go on, tell, <laughs> us, tell us one. Um, God, cool Freshers memories. Uh, probably, who was playing... Chico's or something was playing and it was just like a really good night I remember like the, one of the biggest clubs in Ireland and just me and all my mates went there we had like a race day before that it was like Freshers race day and, <laughs> and then Chico's was playing so probably that yeah to be honest I, I was drunk for a lot of the Freshers week so I can't remember <laughs> love to hear it yeah, so, yeah. so are we yeah. 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 so was everyone yeah. Yeah, yeah. well yeah um, good luck on your set we Thanks can't wait much. to see it yeah. and yeah. can't wait to play thanks for having me on lads thank you alright and you. you want to listen? Can you do like a quick stab that we play on the radio? 100%. Like for the Shane Cloud and you're listening to University Radio Bath or something? Yeah, yeah it was good. University of Radio Pop. University Radio Bath. University of Bath. Oh, Bath. Okay. And <laughs> so. um, hi, this is Shane Cod and you're. Well, we always mess these up. <laughs> the, the hi, this is Shane Cod and you're listening to the University of Radio. Ah, oh, shit. One more time. And, and you're listening to University Radio Bath. <laughs> University Radio Bath. Hi, this is Shane Cod and you're listening to University Radio Bath. Amazing. Thank you. He did it. He did it. I
only that. three times. Uh, yeah. <laughs> first, first live in-person interview. So. Amazing. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks for having me, guys.